Hey, welcome back to Cobb's Q. Today, we are doing thigh bites wrapped in bacon with a little sliver of jalapeno. And I'm telling you, these appetizers, you can't beat them. They are fantastic. And then we just touch them with a little bit of barbecue sauce at the end. So, this is a quick video. Let's get busy. Go out and prepare the chicken. All right, to prepare the thigh bites, we're going to go ahead and just take some of the thighs. And I like to cut the fat off just to make sure that that's not in the bite. And then these are kind of thin, but what I'm going to do is just cut a couple strips because I want these as bite-sized pieces. And some of these pieces like this, what we'll do is we'll wrap it like that, and then we'll wrap the bacon around it. So we'll do this. We get just a couple bites per thigh. That was thick enough. We're going to put that twice. And then we do this for every one of these really simple recipe all right now that we have that ready we're just going to bring chicken over i'm going to hit it with some duck fat and then i'm going to use holy voodoo today so we're also going to put a little slice of jalapeno inside as we wrap it in bacon so we want that flavor the holy voodoo is a little salty so we only want to put so much on here and then what we're going to do is we're going to get this mixed in really well and there we go. This is a great little appetizer. We're going to let this sit for four hours and we'll be back. Okay, it's time to go ahead and put our chicken thigh bites together. Uh, I have been letting a jalapeno kind of soften on the egg for a little bit. We just took a jalapeno, sliced it in half, set it on there. It's been on there for about 20 minutes. I'm going to grab that off right quick. It's definitely soft and hot. We're going to place a slice of that inside of each one of these. So I'm just going to slice these in little thin slivers. Set those aside, and knowing the size of these, I'll probably cut that in half. All right, those are set aside. A little smoke flavor on them. So we're gonna take a piece of chicken, take a slice of bacon. I got some really bad bacon here. Oh well. I'm gonna take a piece of jalapeno, put it right in the center, fold this over the top of itself. Take one of these that here. I'm going to pin that together. And now I'm going to take the other part of the bacon. Such a nice strip of bacon. Pop this over. Come over this side here and I'm going to take the skewer put the skewer right through that to hold that in place. We're going to fit four or five of those on there just like that. Okay, now that we've completed getting these together and we did run out of bacon, so we're uh, three shy of what I wanted, we're going to go ahead and put some of this Holy Voodoo back on, flip them. We're going to put this on between 250, 275 for about an hour to an hour and a half, and uh, we'll take a look at the bacon, and we're looking for about 165 internal with the chicken. So let's go ahead and get this on. It's easier if I hold this. Again, we're going to go for about an hour and a half, and we'll come back. We're going to flip them in about 45 minutes and see how they're looking. Okay, it's been about an hour and 20 minutes. Yeah, those look great. So what we're going to do is we're going to finish them off with a little bit of barbecue sauce. And then we're going to let them go for about five to 10 minutes just to thicken that up a bit, make it tacky, and we'll pull them off. Okay, it's time. Let's go ahead and pull these off. Oh, they look really nice. Not too shabby. Take that. And we'll bring these over. Man, these things look fantastic. All right. And as always, we're going to go ahead and bring the cameraman in so we can try these amazing thigh bites and see what he thinks. Come Man, on in. I can't wait. We've been waiting a while, and I can't wait for this. Look at the pretty color of the barbecue sauce that came oh out on gosh, that. Gosh, it synced in really right. well. Well, this will work out. I'll take one. Yeah, take I'll one. let you take one, then I'll take one. 
without throwing it onto the table. Mm-hmm. All right. There is a toothpick in it, so please be careful. All right. See, I'm trying to locate said toothpick. That's really hot. I think what I'm going to do is take a bite. Mm -hmm. Oh, mine didn't have a toothpick. Yay. Well, there you go. I'm waiting on you. <laughs> and the nice thing is here, you got the jalapeno inside of it. Got the bacon covering and the chicken. So, give yep. it a go. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm, that jalapeno has a good touch mm -hmm. in the barbecue. No, Holy Voodoo's got a really good flavor that goes along with it. Ooh. Well, that's excellent for little little appetizers mm -hmm. at a gathering. That's fantastic. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Just one problem. I'd make this my meal. Now, the only problem is you've had yours. Those are mine. Yeah. Well, you know, no cook gets the food. Anyway, give this a shot. I think you'll like this. Uh, it's really simple, and the flavor is freaking good. <laughs> it's pretty good. So take a moment, if you would, like and subscribe. And thank you very much for joining us today. Have a blessed day. Mm.